Okay. Name our second one: horrifying crashes. Um. I mean, I'm gonna go you grab know. a bunch of Katerium here. I've actually got a smelter that I had set up for Katerium ingots. So, um, can we actually mine them yet? Oh yeah, yeah. No, I blew up a rock over here a long time ago. How how far out are they? You know where the coal is? Uh oh, right. Yes, yeah, next to that. Do you think we can run a belt? Yeah, easily. I was actually trying to do that. Do it. Um, but now that I think about it, I've only got like 16 of the conveyor. I'll grab a, a load of them and then bring it back. And, ooh, what's sparkling? I yeah. hear noises. Uh, and spark. pigs. Angry pigs. Oh god, pigs. Um. Again. Missing iron plates. Oh, Wait, what? And iron plates? Oh, I need iron plates for that. It's a summer's loop. Ah. Uh, does not really help. Yeah, let me let me grab just a stack of Caterium ore, come back, throw it in the smelter, and then um, murder pigs. Missing iron rods. <sighs> that was this one? Yeah. See, so, I set yeah, up. I just like the fact. I'm glad I set up a mall. Oh, yeah. It does make it easier. Uh, I do like the fact that there is renewable biomass, and uh, it's from the critters. <laughs> yeah. Does this actually not feed anything out? Oh, I bet you yeah, I've done that too close to the... It's knocking out 240 minutes of coal, but we've got oil now, so we really don't need coal. Oh, let's give me coal, why not? Do you not? Have I done buggered it by trying to put that thing in right at the entrance? I have to move a couple of these <laughs> just your containers. Oh well. Let's see. If I just do. Yay! Oh, if I knew I could put like signs up and stuff, I'd just put like a giant welcome to the mall sign. I don't have a mine on the uh, Caterium node. Um, I got the auto miners, at least there's that. Yeah. I could make one, I think. Oh, no, no. If I'm going to do a number two, then I need ten encased industrial beams, which... Which uh, requires. Damn it, no, I can't see that. Alright, well. Yeah, I'm just doing the final bits of sorting in this slot that I needed to do. Uh, looks like that's gonna be pipe. Looks like this one's gonna be rotors. Yeah, the only one that's a real dick about this is the first box, because that's got all random ores and stuff in as well. Uh, no. Pickle. Have any pipes in here? No. Have any of these? Yes. Oh, glad I got around to sorting this at some point. Oh, uh, do you need Sam or for uh, research at all? I don't believe the alien metal is in the game yet. Like, or I mean, it's in the game, but. I don't think it does anything yet. Okay. 
Uh, well, that's, still, hello, Just. That's mildly annoying. But never mind. Yeah, I actually, uh, I used to know where there was like a pure node actually not too far from here, but um, I, I, like I said, I don't think it actually does anything yet. Unless, actually, it could be, we, oh, sorry, it could be we can't do anything with it until like tier 6. Uh, it's possible, like I, ha I haven't seen the latest stuff. Yeah. And there are um, some weird, you know, I'll bet they're going to add in like anti-gravity and crap like that. I hope so. Proper oh, flight yeah. belts and stuff like that. Oh, that'd be fun. Oh, why did I come here? I didn't come here. Oh, yeah, I came here to put... Tell you what. <sighs> Borksite? Oh, that's aluminium. Okay. Oh, I need some biomass on me. Uh, let's take the... I don't need the sulfur yet. No, oh, I got mycelium in there. Why have I got mycelium in two places? Uh, because I had a lot of it. Yeah. That's fine. I'm just doing a minor rearrange because then it's, it's a bit more. Personally, I hope they have like automated greenhouse factories or something like that, so we can automate like. Automating biomass would be cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Actually, growing your own pale berries and stuff. I mean, because that that would be useful. Yeah. Um, even if it's only the ba the barrel nuts, you can uh, automate. Which I just I, I always it kills me that I never got the pun on those for so long. Yeah. Oh, barrel barrel nuts. Yeah. Yep. They're all like that. Like the uh, the the green like jelly pads that uh, keep you from taking fall damage. You know what they're called? Uh... Green jelly pads. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You jelly? You jelly yet? Yeah. They've got... They... they I mean... Oh, wow. Okay, so... Um, screws are officially the uh, stopping point here. Yeah, I figured as much. Like I said, we can hook it back into the uh, the other networks to keep it going. Um, if we're not going to be making the modular frames. But... Yeah, I'm just uh, emptying my inventory of screws. Because that's the other thing. is If we can get rid of all the overflow in the mall that's not necessary materials like screws we don't do need we, do we have a steel beam um, storage just like just a steel beams yeah there's, there's uh, one which is about half full in the mall the mall got it okay does you it know, actually have a feed going into it uh no this is just what I moved so there's only like 10, 10, 10 15 stacks in there so we need labels um Actually, you don't. If you'll, you'll see what I've done when you come down here. Oh, that's clever. Yep. That is smart. Uh, the two at the end need pulling out and redoing, so i uh, take all. There we go. Because I accidentally put a really short conveyor in, and the really short conveyor doesn't like it. But... I've basically sorted everything out on here. And we'll probably do it that this becomes, like... Once we got, I think it's the top end smart sorters. Um, programmable. The programmable ones. You can do. I, I wonder if you can do an overflow. So that if it stops going all in one direction, it'll just feed out the side. At which point, this becomes know. the overflow. And then, it, and once this so. fills up, then the then we have another overflow that goes to the um, grinder, which which will stop all sorts of uh, backlog. Okay. I gotta make a whole bunch of quick wire here. Missing steel beams, missing steel pipes. Hey, look, I've got a mall. <sighs> I'm missing some things. I can just go in here, and if my inventory is empty, grab a bot pile. Steel beam. Grab another pile. Nine, rod nine plate. If you only need a couple, you can just grab it off the belt. I was going to put 
rotor. If I put stators in this one, and then if I didn't have the full inventory, it'd be so much easier. I tell you what, I need a. I need more storage. Yeah, have a random crap, random amount of crap. Storage is like the biggest barrier in this game sometimes. Yeah. Yeah, this is why getting a good storage system. This is the other reason for having the base raised up a bit. You've got space underneath to fit complex sorting algorithms, complex sorting shit. So. Do you want to make a radar tower? Uh, how much do they cost? Well, like, have we got research, the we need... Well, it takes 100 crystal oscillators and 50 heavy modular frames. Alternatively, we can get the Explorer, which is 10 crystal oscillators and 100 modular frames, and they're like the best thing to just go driving around with. They handle any kind of terrain just about. They, they can't go up cliffs, but... I've never driven one. I think we should do that then. I think that's need... going to be entertaining. We still need what? Still got to get trains, but... Meanwhile... Yeah, well, it's a, set, it's a different research tree. Because we need computers yet, and computers is gonna. Computers is literally why I'm sorting stuff so I've got everything ready. <laughs> sort. Okay. Do, does any part of your mall have cables? Uh, no. Not yet. Um. Because copper stuff didn't end up in the pile. Actually, yes, it does. Next to uh, wire. Okay. Well, when we get the Caterium over here, because it's only going to be taking 15 ingots a minute, and I'll be putting a level two mine on there, so we can we can knock out quite a few Caterium ingots here once I'm uh, once I got this set up. Oh, goody. Wire for days. Yep. So I want that. And sort. wire and whatever else. Yeah. Well, the other thing is, I need to. This is going to end up deconstructing the uh, old manufacturing floor. Because this is going to go all the way over to the copper. And in fact, the copper is going to feed directly into this. Oh, oh, oh. Right, that's where the end of the factory is going to be. That, that's going to be an entrance or an exit. Figure it out. I need another fifty frames. And that's the end of the factory because I've not got the height for it. Uh, there. Why do I have the um, paved paradise going through my head at the moment? <laughs> you know, I think that's supposed to be like a, a part of the game. Like, you're literally building over the entire planet to make your factory and stuff. That's actually something that they have in a lot of the trailers, too. It's just like, everything going giant... built. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Like, it's all steel and concrete and stuff. But it really does suck because you start with such a gorgeous environment. Uh, we're actually getting low on modular frames, so I'm going to start it back up again on these... Uh, yeah, you'll have to just wire them in. They should, it should just start up, but it's not going to be enough to keep up with uh, incoming. Ooh. I've got another 50 heavy modular frames. Uh, in fact, I'm going to... I'm missing steel beam. It's hearing that all start up is quite cool. Manufacturer sounds awesome. Oh, where do we actually... Uh, there's a run of... Um... Yeah, I'm just trying to see where the actual connection is supposed to be. Oh, there's... It's about... It's... <sighs> They're next to the... Um... Instructors. Okay, okay. So there's one... that One here. That's the one that'll do this line. 
There's one next, and then there's one next to. Oh, this constructor will get turned on by that one. Uh, there you go. There's one here, and then there's one next to the next uh, assembler. Next um, assembler that'll do the other one. There's Jesus, man! I can't find any of these things. Oh, okay, here's one, I think. Where are you? Also, check this out. Yeah. Power pole, MK2, seven connections. So go here. Oh, yeah. Uh, it's not that one, but never mind. Oh, yeah, it's actually, it's those, and there's also some more back here. I never connected these all back up. I'm stood next to one. Yeah, and then I can take this and just bring it back over to that. And there's that another one. Like one for another one to the left. Oh, no. Have you already done this one? Yeah, no, there's one here as well. Uh, actually, hang on a minute. If I do... I don't have any cable. <laughs> that doesn't help. Not a problem. Uh, not that one. Well, that one and also the one behind it. The one next to me. Uh, you're right there. Yep, there you go. You got it. Uh, yeah, this needs rewiring. <laughs> this is why there's a nice daisy chain of just tier four, or tier ones like along the wall over there, because it's just nice and neat for getting everything in. We could if we needed to overclock the uh, modular frame production. If option. you can get that to go up to 25 a minute, but I don't we think you can get the uh, input because I've only got three making it. I think we could probably get that up to get get this up to like, well, we need five. If we had five running, I think we've got enough incoming over here if we consolidate the screws into like the fastest we can get the screw into like you know four screws into 200 we'll probably do it but it's why does this not have power this looks like it should have power i don't know <laughs> oh it does now haha <laughs> and then we look at the power usage and cry a little I don't think it's going to be that bad. Whoa, yeah, it did spike a bit there, but... <laughs> yeah, there's a bit of a spiky, spikiness going on. I'm not sure why. There's still why. lots of room. Like, even at our worst, we're looking at, like, 700 out of, out of, out of 1,000, so... Yeah. If worst comes to worst, we can just knock out another oil rig somewhere. It's true. Um, hey, mind. hey, mind. Get in here so I can stab you in the face. Well, okay, yes. get in here so I can kill you when I stab you in the face. Roger, Roger. <laughs> Thirty-seven point five rods a minute, and it takes how much? Let's see, we've got that. Okay, is this ready? This is basically the mall is at least open. Um. So that one rod manufacturing is going to everything. I and it's already overclocked. Yeah, that thing. Another. That's that. That's yeah. That's how dodgy right. that first bit was. That first bit was literally. That's why every. That's why it probably all needs redesigning. Oops. What I'm going to do instead then is I'm going to create a buffer. Yep. Have no fear. I Mine freezes fear. here. Right now I can stab him in the face. Um. Ah. <laughs> uh. Okay. Go ahead and upgrade these belts. I've got two power slugs. I'll put the power slugs in there because they're basically there. Sort. Did I not? Okay, I'm intrigued where I got the re spare reinforced beams from, but I have 41 in case beams. So these are. Um, these you've got on? some uh, thingies making reinforced. Yeah, I've just put them into. Uh, into that, so I must have picked them up by accident from here. I'm gonna un overclock the manufacturer, okay? Because it's the uh, the it's slowing down on um, Whoa, some of the incoming. Wow! Yeah, uh, mine just walks up and hits me with the uh, thing, and my game just froze. But let's not do that for the time being, <laughs> <laughs> please. Well, um, no, no, no rebar gun for the time being, I suppose. <laughs> Yeah. I mean, it's in the title. Experimental. I don't know what they've actually fixed I, in this patch. Thinking that. I was experimenting. 
Yeah, we found we experimented. Space. We experimented so hard it crashed. Um, have a quick look at the patch notes just in case there's anything. Uh, I didn't see any. I don't know. I'll be right back. Oh, it, oh, hang on. What? They do, but they do. That's not it. Integrated objects like the hub biomaspin terminal can no longer be copied via the middle mouse button. You can make another hub. Oh, the instances of all the integrated hub objects that have already been built should also be dismantleable now. So you can actually take the biomass burners off the hub now. Oh, good, because those are bothering me. Yeah. Um. Nope, it's not working. Okay. Uh... Oh, that's alright. That was my turn. Oh, right. Oh, into okay, oh, five minutes of the Okay, you can't just mantle them. Sorry, they, they meant something else there. You can't just middle click things to copy them. It's a pity you can't. Never mind. Ah, okay. There's the thing. So it's not one to one on ingots for criterion, it's a three to one. That's the balance. Still, I think that's a normal node. So if I go, let's see, 120, overclock that twice, that's 240. That's yeah, plenty. so I, I think we can still... Yeah. yeah, that's a good amount. Okay. Mm. Bonk. Okay. Um, right. I'm starting to pull apart the old factory, I think. Have I got an inventory space for it? No, not yet. Let's... Let's empty some of this inventory. Get s... Fire... Do I have one for copper sheet? No, not yet. Okay, I'm gonna put one down for copper sheet. Actually, I need to, I need we need to move all these ores I've got because they're useless. I honestly just toss those into the coupon thingy. Yeah. It's not going to be much, but... I'm just putting them in a box quickly. I mean, the ones that we don't want to get rid of, that's the other thing. I don't want to get rid of some of them, because some of them is like sulfur. Or bauxite. Yeah, yeah. There's a few, there's a few have, of them. We have a like... mine. We have a mine on sulfur and quartz. Well, we got automated things on uh, quartz. Um, we don't have a um, mine, per se, up there. Yeah. Well, it's semi-automated. Yeah, getting power over to it's going to be a pain. Um, let me rearrange this slightly. I can move these two. I keep finding random chests out here with 23 iron plates and 38 coal. It's always 23 iron plates and 38 coal. Like, every single one of them. There's yeah, that's, three of them. That's because it's 23 iron plates is 23 meters of... Um, uh, ah, thing. and that's the coal you dumped on the ground. Yeah. Got it. Okay. Yeah. I can't afford it. Just suddenly it all makes sense. Yeah. <sighs> okay, this can be wire. This can be cable. This can be copper sheet. Yes, I've just moved all that stuff. It's going to be fine. Spitter, no spitting. No spitter. That's a bad spitter. Uh, I can put make this one concrete. Where the hell did I get a heat sink from? 
Oh, that bodes well. <laughs> uh, this one will be quick wire. I did even love a hair heat sinks. Looks like it's a new thing. Um, Yay. I don't know what it is, but it's going in this one. Wow. I think that is most of my inventory all sorted. All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. Welcome back. No worries, man. I was working on a car today and left all my tools and the jack, all that shit in my wife's truck. I bet she was happy about that. Not so much. Oddly enough. Words were had. Yeah, she told me to get my shit out of her car. <laughs> oh, in case you're wondering, I have the other five power shards in my inventory. God damn it, mind. <laughs> hey, I don't feel so bad anymore. I had to go out and find all the ones I've uh, all, all the ones I needed last time. Yeah, mind. I had twenty in my inventory. <laughs> I, had to, I had to literally go out and find three green slugs just to overclock something. And we had like, because I, I was like, where the hell are they? Yeah. <laughs> I uh, blame it on Griff. Yeah. Yeah. But well, welcome to the mall. Stuff this thing needs. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Look at some of the sub components for those. Holy Jesus! The adaptive control unit. Yep. Bar to the face. Uh, okay. You're going down, pig. Okay, my inventory is now full. <laughs> pig, be done. Are you working on a specific piece right now? Uh, we're clearing up the. So this is why I just set them this mall up. Uh, we're clearing up the old, old, the old bit of the factory that leads all the way back to the mam and stuff and the bit and the um. Okay. Thing, uh, putting it into the. And I will do some maths real quick. Yeah, because we need to get the next bit is computers. We need to get computers automated at whatever the rate the manufacturer gives them out. Okay. Well, let me math and see about what we need for these adaptive control units, because that seems to be the most intensive. Yeah, well, we can't we, we can't get them all yet, anyway. Why? They haven't unlocked them. Which one hasn't been unlocked? The... Uh... Engine? The adaptive control units. We haven't um, unlocked the ability to make them yet. Yes? I'm oh, gonna be kind of upset. Okay. Because I got all the way out here. Oh no, we have gotten them, mind. And yeah, I, I was just gonna realized. Say. But I, I had a hundred modular frames that I used to start the Explorer tech, and it takes ten modular frames to build the mine. And I forgot about that. So I'm coming back. Again. are organized. Oh yeah, yeah. We're so organized. The nice thing is between the Blade Runners and the uh, Tier 3 conveyor belt, man, I can make pretty good time coming back. Getting there takes a little bit longer, but... Yeah. You know, I'm half tempted to set up a row of smart splitters behind all this so we can just dump it all in and it spits it all out. Uh, that would have been my take on it. Like, anything that you have... Uh, I, I wish we could just set up to split off overflow. Yeah, I think that's. I think that is what the um, the next one, the the uh, special, the special one that we haven't got yet, can do. Because that'll Program probably do. That'll do amounts. Yeah. I think that one does amounts. Ah, uh, we can hope. Yeah. Okay. Let me have a quick look at how much the smart splitters cost. They cost. It's the one AI limiter that's the crunch point on that. How do you make AI limiters? Uh, we've got one sitting in the... Uh, ah, the this is why I wasn't making them. Uh, 20 quick wire each. Okay. Oh, I brought back a whole bunch of Caterium. I'll throw it in the smelter. Oh, okay. check the uh, check the constructor I got right next to the hub. I, I so put that onto quick wire and I put a bunch of ingots in. We okay. need 750 automated wire, 500 circuit boards, 100 heavy modular frames, and 100 computers. For the adaptive deals. 
It's not too bad, I suppose. No. 